The governor of Peter Mbavi Nugu State has condemned Simon Ekma, the Finland-based leader of the autopilot group, as a businessman exploiting the emotions and suffering of the Igbo people. Mba urged the people of the Southeast region to disregard Ekpa's threats and seated home orders. Mba also expressed displeasure over the Finnish government's continued harboring of Ekpa, even as many lives and properties have been lost due to the alleged actions of Ekpa's supporters. The governor made these remarks during a weekend meeting with members of the House of Representatives Committee on National Security and Intelligence, who were visiting the state to inspect the construction of the Department of State Service Training Institute. Institute in Ogo. Mba emphasized the importance of security, which has informed his administration's decision to end the seat at home orders previously enforced by non state actors who had held the people of the Southeast hostage, both psychologically and economically. Our people are known for hard work. That's, it. That's who we are. That is uh, in our DNA, is a uh, I mean, that's our, our, our civic habits. We, we enjoy working hard. And this man sits somewhere and tell and says he, he, he loves the evil and dictates to us not to go to work. Okay, so I want to um, also take this opportunity to call on our people to disregard this threat, disregard him and his threat. Right, we have demonstrated our capacity to provide security for our people and we will continue to do so. We are the true representative of people and we are working day and night and there is nothing as a palliative that can solve the problem. That's why we are here to assess the level of security, interact with His Excellency. If all governors across the nation and leaders will emulate his plans, what he is trying to do, and what he have done so far in Inugu within 360 days, people will go back to farm and going back to farm will entail peace, security and stability. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.